for well. us as now we have the drivers on the grid new game new season Eero is back racing in a free as we are on the way that's a very good start from bios terrible start from ken as he drops down to jesus christ p14 bios in control of the race camille in p2 with a mercedes he is under pressure from micro micro mash tries to go around the outside now down the inside of the mercedes camille tries to cover him around the outside but williams gets the place has to now defend from camille in behind as now alex tries to go for the look maybe on a mercedes round the outside into lawfield what's it gonna be is it gonna be the mercedes or the vika now matthew wrongson is trying to maybe take an advantage over the fight going on ahead of him but it's a perfect start from bios who's in complete control of the race right now oh that's gonna be side by side into cops corner ferrari on the inside and he gets the move done that's a very brave overtake but here comes and the other ferrari of sam kent exactly. into maggots and beckett's oh god how are they still going as i think micromaster might be no he's still staying behind he really likes that second place on the track and there was a bit of contact between Kent and Foley, and I actually seen a bit of an end play, a bit of carbon fiber flying into the wind. So I think Kent has got wing damage, and that's going to yeah, compromise Kent him. Yeah, has no end plate. Yeah. Left, uh, left end plate is gone. Into Maggots and Beckett's they go. Micromash has taken the lead. We're just going to stick with Bios and Foley at the moment and just join them momentarily. I think that was a DRS assisted overtake. And, and, and Ronan, Ronan's down to P9. What happened there? Oh, because he spun, didn't he? Yeah, he did. But that's a huge train behind... Man, what is his name? I, I, Fola. I'm completely forget it. Fola, okay. Oh, oh there's, there's a lot of contact there. there. Flying. I think a completely destroyed front wing on Nasdaq. Yeah. Uh, Williams. No, no safety car as just as yet. Same. Matthew up to P3. And, uh, but Alex Theodore with the switchback. Ooh la la. That was sexy there. Alex Tudor. And now could Bios go for the move into P3. Oh, Roll Matthew's going to be swamped here. He goes, oh my goodness, wow. and going three wide. Matthew is not giving this one up, but he has to because Bios is so quick. Now tries to go for the look into the broken this contact tap on the left, uh, front left wheel. He's still going to go for the move into on the old pitch straight into Copper's Corner. He backs out. No chance to go for the move there. Uh, Alex defending his position. Now there's a yellow as flag as Colin Ogden has, has lost the car and that's going to bring car. out the safety car. Oh my god. I'm trying to get your breath ladies and gentlemen. This has been a very intense start. Does the field pit onto the hard tyres? That is the question. Restart racing as he, did, as he does now. It's a decent restart for the McLaren. He's already gapping the Williams but the Williams is closing in fast who has a very quick Mercedes round behind him could can we potentially go for the move into Vale Micromash is defending the inside line but it's contact and Micromash spins probably has damage on his front wing drops down to fourth uh, third fourth place and uh, Camille is now leading I don't know what happened to Dan Marquez. He is into the, in the into the grass as I'm running out of words to say. Alex up to P2, disregarding this penalty, of course. The DRS detection point tries to go for a better line through loop. And look how close he is. I don't think he's even going to need the DRS to help him start contact between the leading pair of, the, of uh, drivers. But they're still going side by side. The DRS wasn't enough for to help the Mercedes go back into the lead. Could he possibly go for the switchback all around the outside using his medium compound tires? But Alex positions his V cub beautifully and uh, keeps Camille behind, defending the inside line, approaching cops. It's not gonna be too wide. No 2021 repeating this time around but there's still bottling for the lead Camus tries to hang around the outside as goes Cal on the gets track. a three second time penalty we oh. approach the veil chicane this oh very brave uh, from alex there he just cut across the mercedes i don't know how there was no contact but he still keep it clean as Camus approaches down towards abby backs out 
Camus, this time he has to make the move. No, look how fast the Alex is, but Camus is still gonna dive down the inside. Mercedes back into the lead. Alex, not giving up, has the inside line through, uh, through Lafield. No, but look at that exit from Camille. What? This is the tire advantage that the Mercedes has, and they go side by side through cops. Who's it gonna be? It's gonna be Alex on the inside. Camus tries to hug around the outside, but it has no chance to go back into the lead for uh, before Maggots and Beckett's. That for P15. The interesting thing here is that uh, Camille, Camille has no battery left. The drivers in front of him have plenty of batteries. Matthew, Matthew gets a three second time penalty. Oh god. It goes very wide, it almost spins, mm. saves it, Camu goes up to P3. What was that from the Red Bull driver? I don't know. Mark, Micromash stays behind Alex. He, all of them are so close be, uh, to each other. There was almost contact going from Maggots and Beckett. Camel using all of his battery. Well, he didn't have much to begin with, but now he's vulnerable from Matthew Ronson from behind. Rebel trying to push the Mercedes to his absolute limits. I think there was a double move to defend his position from Camille. But well, here comes Matthew, Matthew into the inside. chicane. Oh. And switch back over, there was a side tap of oversteer for the Red Bull, but so was for Mercedes. And they sort of dropped back behind uh, Micromash. And with Matthew, so this no, plays perfectly into Louis. He's got the DRS. He's got the DRS. As, oh, just about, okay. As Louis is actually going to make uh, a Michael move now for the win. That's bold, that's whiskey, I love it. Oh. Micromash around the outside, there's contact. Alex into the grass being pushed there by Micromash. There could be some... Reports. If, if you're Louis here, I don't know why you're doing it though, because you don't Wait, need Alex to. Alex coming back into Cobb's corner. They go side by side. There was slight contact <laughs> between these two. Alex Sark is the place back. Although I think that actually plays into Michael Mash's hands quite nicely because he will get the DRS again and he well almost has the the, the battery advantage as well but well, the... <laughs> that allowed, sorry to talk to you but that allowed the, the Camu and Matthew to come back into the DRS that's absolutely what insane and the interesting thing here is this all plays into Louis Wood's hands he doesn't need to make a move on the track he doesn't have to win this race on the track with everyone's time penalties around him, this is his for the taking. Just keep the car on the road for the next five laps. Okay, the tire deck is going to be a bit of an issue, but here comes Matthew on Louis. He's really gaining into Abby, but he's not going to make the move there. It is a bit more arcadey, but it's still good. Yeah, I love it. And Absolutely Bios has made a great recovery now up to P5. Obviously, he's got a few penalties that he's going to have to deal with, but he's really showing his pace here, Lex Hod. Um. As Matthew now up to P3 on the track, these drivers are all going very slow. I think it's a lap driver or something there. It well, I think is, it's Foley. It oh! Oh! Oh, I missed it! I missed it! As is absolute chaos, and that will bring out the safety car as Camille and Matthew both taken out the two, two contenders in this race. I just caught the end of it there. It looked like Camel made a move into Abbey, or into um, Club, sorry. And... Well, they just both died. And you and just go straight. And he has gone after here. As he went. And yeah, it's going to be very interesting. Edzak in P2, already dropping back. Kent right behind him. Of course, they can't overtake unless they reach uh, the start finish line. But Kent already sliding. Alex tries to go for the move into the first corner, but has to back. Back out, no chance for him, and that's gonna hamper Micromash because he still has two drivers to overtake on track. Oh! Alex sends it down the inside, that opens up a door for Micromash, who tries to go past Ma Alex. Uh, Edzak still ahead of them, but Micromash has just one more guy ahead of him to win this race. Maybe not on track, but after the penalties. And I'm thinking Sam Kent there has been spun by his own teammate who drove through him when he was ghosted. And as a result of that, Sam stopped all the way down to PA after showing so much promise here. Disaster. 
and Zach, Alex and Michael Mouse are all going basically side by side. Alex round the outside in Cobb's corner. Michael Mouse tries to join him but it's blocked by his own teammate. They approach Magnus and Beckett. I think this is all won for Michael Mouse. Bios has no chance to win. Alex now no chance as well. Michael Mouse is basically already a winner as he has just one more guy ahead of him. He doesn't really have to look back because no one is really pushing from behind. Pause. Uh, mm. Michael Mashi. Ronan. Uh, but saying that, Zach. Ronan has overtaken Edgar Phillips. And is he going to get P2 in this opening round? Bastian Vries also in the contention. Ed Zach also in the contention. As they're going into the final few corners Vries here. He sends around the outside. Oh, God. And Alex and wins it on the track. Micromash wins it after the penalties. Another 10 second time penalty for Bios. And uh, Ron Sorensen Ron Sor and Ed Zach on his 19 oh. lap hard tires finishes on the podium. It's a Williams 1 and 3, Aston Martin 2 and 4, Isford in the 5th, Alex finishes in 6th, Bios. Very unfortunate race for him, but a decent recovery is right. Uh, Makes him finish in seventh, Kent eighth, Axel ninth, Dan Marquez in tenth, Marco in his Red Bull eleventh, and completing the points is the truth who hasn't finished the race yet. He finishes right now, and we are done with the opening round. United Kingdom, oh no, you can't just gonna do British Grand Prix, United Kingdom Grand, oh, Kingdom Grand Prix, what wow. have I just said? I'm just well, tired at this the point. The maiden round of season